yo guys i'm going to show you guys how to download and install worst plus three so i don't know if many people know but worst plus three is actually a decent client now worst plus two is very outdated now but now worst plus three is out and it has some really good features so first of all you guys are going to click the first link in the description and it will be his github and you're going to be it's going to go here right you're going to go right here you click on that then you're going to go down and then you guys will see something right here just so you guys see let's click on here and then you're going to download the newest um version i actually don't have this version yet so it's pretty cool to get then you're going to press keep it won't harm your computer once you have that there you're going to exit out for now and then once you're over here on your desktop you're going to go right here and then you're going to search up worst plus three and you're just going to open the file location the drag under the desktop keep it there for now now you guys want to go download forge so you're going to do forge 1.12.2 download this is only for 1.12.2 i'm 99 percent sure so you're going to download it from here make sure you download the newest version installer and wait for this to go ahead and then you're going to be on one of these pages uh this will all be blacked out or blurred out so you guys want to look at this and then you guys are going to press skip and then you're going to get a forge jar and you press keep and you can just and then you got to wait for it to actually fully download so now it's fully downloaded you're just going to click it and you can put that out and you're going to press install client and make sure you guys have ran 1.12.2 normally already so yeah and then press ok then that's going to be done then you're going to go in here. So a lot of the time people always like, it doesn't show up, it doesn't show up. You're going to go to installation, just check off modded. Okay. And new installation. But right now I have beta thing on. So you're going to have to restart your launcher a couple thing, a couple times. Right here, you're going to click on this. You're going to do this and then go into your JVM arguments. Put the amount of RAM that you guys want. So I would like 12 gigabytes of RAM. So, and then you're going to have it probably down here most likely. And then, um, keep it there for now. Now you're going to press percent, update a percent. And then you're going to go over here. Um, the reason, um, make, if you guys are on Mac, press Command Shift G, and you're going to be in a saves folder, and you're going to change that to, um, dot Minecraft. Then you'll be in here. So you're going to go to dot Minecraft. You're going to have all these folders. I have a lot more than I should. I have a lot of folders. But, um, yeah, and then you're going to go down to your mods. If you guys don't have mods, I'll show you guys how quickly how to create a folder. And do new folder, and then mods, and then boom. But yeah, I don't want that here. Alright, you guys are down to your mods folder. Once you dragged it in here, you're going to click on it. And then you guys are going to grab the stuff that you want in here. If you guys want Optify and everything, you guys can. Uh, So yeah. Alright, right here, now you're going to drag it into your mods folder. And then you're done with that. Now, if you guys want to run it, like actually... You guys are going to press play on the Forge thing. By the way, there's nothing wrong with this. It's just an older version, so it's going to say that. But I just press play. And then wait for it to load. And I'll see you guys once it's loaded. So now, guys, you guys are going to be in here. Um, There's going to be music in the background, but I turned it off because, well, yeah. There's just a bunch of different YouTube channels, modules, and stuff. But it's pretty cool. So I'm just going to I'll see you guys. Oh, yeah, by the way, the fellas is a multiplayer. As you guys see. Okay, so now, yeah, so uh, you can press right shift to open up the GUI. My thingy is way too far out. So you're going to press this, and then you're going to see this GUI. It is sick. I heard that they have a decent, um, has a decent crystal aura. Burrow is a brand new module, but I'm not doing config with you right here. But, like, yeah, I, I've used it before, but I actually didn't. This is actually a new version of it. So, you guys, it's pretty cool. So, I actually might use this to hack on some random servers. Because it looks like it's actually a pretty cool thing. There's some servers, like, there's some servers with the worst guy to keep the world I could hack on. There's one that I know. I'll boot you, maybe.